Missing home in mission is ensuring the safety of residents by prohibiting visits until further notice. Our Rocio Villalobos explains. People no longer permitted to visit their loved ones here at Waterford Gardens. This is a measure nursing homes across the valley are taking in order to prevent the spread of COVID-19. The director tells us the facility is on lockdown and only the 45 employees are permitted to come and go. They are following guidelines by the Department of Homeland Security and Centers for Disease Control. So we're asking, for example, have you been around somebody who's been out of the country in the last week? Have you been around somebody who's been out of the state? Have you been around anyone who's been or have you been to, for instance, an amusement park or a concert, that sort of thing, where there's many, many people. While there aren't any confirmed cases of the virus in the RGV, the CD states that the elderly and those with chronic medical conditions are at greater risk of becoming very sick from the illness, which is why Waterford Gardens is taking such a drastic precautionary measure. We're actually the safest place to be because the elderly are quarantined, we're having a normal life, everyone's eating wonderfully and doing activities. She says friends and family of the residents have been supportive of the decision, understanding it's for everyone's safety. And though they can't meet in person, they're using technology to maintain face-to-face -face interaction. Call them on the iPad and FaceTime with them, and um, and they'll be able to visit that way. And they understand that their family is the safest that they could be in the situation that they're in. Gavassos tells us she believes the situation will get worse before it gets better, but in any case, they are prepared. In mission for Local 23 News, Rocio Lobos.